Hello Geeks, welcome back to the Geek XP. We're here for even more Walking Dead. We're jumping right into the next episode. Play! Oh, chapter 5. No going back. Ugh, that is a foreboding image there of that zombie. And the last episode, which was a short one, we finished up episode 4, and we decided to leave that little uh, information center to try to get to that town. The, the thought process that we couldn't last there for too long and there was no like even resting Rebecca was not going to get better in the cold with no food so we figured you know tough it out try to make it to town so she can get better we can get heat and some food maybe um and she wasn't doing so hot Arvo showed up and said that I robbed him but I didn't so I'm thinking maybe after Jane left she t went and stole stuff from him uh, and all of his other Slavic Russian friends showed up. One of them and a very intimidating bald fellow with face tattoos. Uh, I don't like him. And then we were in sort of a, a Mexican standoff times 10. And I noticed that Rebecca was not doing so hot, but then she was a zombie. So she just like straight up died holding the baby. And I decided, well, she's going to eat the baby. So I shot her and then all of a sudden everyone started shooting and the screen went black and my heart is uh, destroyed. <laughs> So, we're going to see how <laughs> my awesome decision-making skills pan out. Let's see what we got here. Ugh. That was so dumb, shooting. But who knows what would have happened. So, Previous I leave that to you guys. On the Walking Dead. Previously. Killing one in order to save many is this part guy. of survival. Ha! Ah, and we killed you. I only need a minute. Put you out of your misery right then. When I look at Kenny now, he just, he seems broken. Broken people get reckless. Oh yeah, and Luke was being a dink. Here. Thanks. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. Oh, am I gonna have to choose? Oh, I could like totally just like fail. I don't think I'm gonna do that though. We'll see what happens. Everybody be cool. Why do you remind me of these terrible things? Not cool, Walking Dead. Not cool. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. Telltale Games presents. In association with Skybound Entertainment, The Walking Dead. <laughs> so we're breathing. Go do some gunshots. Did I get shot? Scary close. Hey, what are you doing? I'm saving the baby. Clam, kill the hot cover. You're out the open. I'm not letting that baby die. Are you kidding me? Baby take can't, can't take care of itself. Shit. I didn't even see him out there. Luke. Good work, Clem. Shit. Okay. Okay, we gotta do something, y'all. Get down here. Guess I need down. Can't just sit here and let this guy take pot shots at us till he runs out of ammo. So quit talking about it and do it. Yeah, you're the one with the gun. Yeah, all right. The can not have to get any worse than it already is. Work together. One go. covers, the and the other one has to shoot. The other one takes over and gets them when they pop English, up. motherfucker! They kill every one of you. Wow. Not very articulate. 
ridiculous. Just get over to that side of the wall. I can maybe get an angle on this guy. Cover me, all right? Just shoot over towards the woods. I'll, I'll try. Yeah? Okay. Good. Good. I just need the distraction. Okay, where's my gun? Okay. I have a baby. Okay. I'm not gonna go. Go! Dang it. Hey! What are you? Dang it! God damn it! Everything is terrible. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. Woo! Okay, Kenny, look out, look out. Are you okay? Oh, uh, everything is terrible. Oh, we have to check for the bullet. I'm not just gonna let that be a thing where we. Yeah, it's fine. I'm gonna be fine. I think I'm gonna be fine. We gotta take care of that. Dang it. Kenny, what are you doing? I'm ending this. Get out here! Right fucking now! This is my shield for Dash! Wait, 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 Crap! Crap! Ah, awesome. Okay, well, no, you're the one who decided please. to start this, Arvo. You gotta awesome. deal with this. Jane? Yeah! Yes! Yes! Okay, that's getting a little dark. You can die now. Please die. Go away. Thank you. The power of the Jane compels you. Safe to come out. Here, I got him. Okay. So other than Rebecca, who we lost before, we didn't look like... Doesn't look like we lost anyone in the firefight. But that was grim, to say the least. And Kenny doesn't look like he's doing too hot. Jesus Christ. That was, uh... That was intense. I thought... Nah. I thought that was it. Yeah, it was for these assholes. Thanks for coming back. <sighs> I didn't know this man. I never killed someone that didn't wrong me in some way. That didn't deserve it. Tried to pretend he was a walker. But it's different. You saved us. Yeah. That's why I did it, but it felt wrong. Mm. Takes a lot to make Jane feel that way. She's pretty stone cold most of the time. You sure about this? <sighs> as sure as I'm gonna be. Yeah! Let's go. Oh, man! Jane's in! All right. Blood and iron. Achievement unlocked. Oh. Luke, don't you start shit. Don't even. Don't even. How did this happen? She turned. Just like that. Clem spotted it first. Did what she had to to protect the child. This isn't your fault, okay? She just... She just lost too much blood. Yeah, but I'm the one who suggested... It ain't you. nobody's fault. You saved the boy's life. You know, we could have done better by her. She was just too far gone. She would have been a good mom. Yeah. Yeah, she would have. Oh, this is so heavy. Don't worry, Becca. We'll take care of your boy. You <sighs> rest easy. Oh, dear. Kenny's gonna beat the shit out of someone again. You piece of shit! Ugh. Hey, hey! Okay, Kenny. Stop! Guys! Get off guys, me! Come on! It's over, man. He ain't a threat to us. How can you say that? Of course he is! I need Get to have a conversation with him. Way. Okay, Whoa, Kenny. What are you doing? I'm doing the same thing this asshole tried to do to us. He wasn't the one shooting at us. That guy's dead. Just because he don't have a gun doesn't mean he wouldn't have. Well, okay, you I gotta did it, try to so leave him alone. calm him down. Please don't be like Kenny from this the last game. Food. Please. Where I support you Please, a I lot when you're being reasonable Bullshit. and then you say I'm not no, on no. your side for the whole it's time. It's true. We have place not far for food. See? He wants to help. 
Oh, don't be stupid. He's just trying to save his skin. Why the hell would you help us? Huh? I... I now want to see more people dead. Then close your eyes and I'll make it quick. Kenny, back off. If he's telling the truth, it could save all of us. Ugh. We need the food. None of this will matter if we all starve to death. She's right, Kenny. We're running low on supplies as it is. It's worth the risk to check this place out. Trust him, don't trust him. It doesn't matter. We should go. I don't know why he starts up saying that I robbed him when I clearly can't didn't. Be far from here. You stay out of this. You're the reason these fuckers came after us in the first place. Don't try and pin this on me. Lay off, Kenny. She just helped us. It doesn't matter why it happened. We have to move on. Focus Think on the about future. about the baby, Kenny. If they're oh, so cute. We need them. We ain't gonna last much longer without yeah. more food. We need the food. We gotta take a chance. Unless someone's got a better plan. Come on, Kenny. Come on. Come on back now. Whew. We've left Camp we got Kenny. something to tie this shit bird up. Yeah, I got something. I'm a fan oh, of time. Man, I thank you. Just give me a reason. Yeah, man, he gets it. Luke, that was not... Mm. See, Luke and Kenny keep fighting because they keep on trying to mess with each other. Just stop. They thrive on conflict, it seems. My coffee's gone. Look, I know you're probably pissed about me leaving. When I heard the gunshots, I... I knew it was a mistake. If it helps, the thing I'd normally do is walk away for good. But I didn't. I mean, I'm not despite mad. Despite what my instincts are telling me. Despite everything I've seen. I'm not pissed. Yeah. I'm glad you're back. I didn't want you to go in the first place. Thanks. That's... That's good. Because you're probably 90% of the reason I came back. Because I'm Clementine. And you'd probably get pretty annoying if you hated me the whole time. I mean, I wasn't mad. I was just disappointed. No. Like a dad. That would suck. I'm gonna try to make this work. Oh, she betrays me. All I can do is Ugh. promise you I won't abandon you again. Which, to be fair, I've never done before. Even though I probably should have. A few times now. You don't gotta point the gun at him the whole time. You forget what we just went through? He ain't going anywhere, Kenny. No need to get your arm all sore. I'm worried about Kenny. Kenny's a little itchy right now. He's, he's in a dark place. We got to keep an eye on him. I got to get him out of camp, Kenny. Through. He's lost. Yeah, I've noticed that too. I can't keep saying he's going to be fine. You're the only one that he trusts. That he really trusts. That means you're the one that's going to have to pull him back. I'm down. He's counting on you. If we're really going to make this work, I'll do my best. I know. Mm, gotta save Kenny. Come on, slow pokes. Slow poke. That's what it feels like when I don't get these videos out frequently. <laughs> and now we have another Walking Dead. Slow poke. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, we have Jane back. In terms of the stuff we've lost, this isn't terrible from a pragmatic standpoint, but still, this is a lot, and I'm worried about Kenny. He seemed to be doing well before. I'm hoping the baby might Wait up. Wait. give him reason to... Wait, stop. No, no, I think it might have I'm been baby fine. and Rebecca. Hey, I just need a him. second. All right. Sorry, I just, I just put more weight on it than I should have. We need to take care All of right, that. All right, wait there. Arvo, hey, stop what I say? Arvo, stop. When I tell you something, you fucking listen, okay, you understand? Not Kenny, helping. come on! There's no need for that! He's getting what he deserves. Ugh. I'm fucking talking to you! I say stop. You'd best stop! Kenny! Please he listen, understands. Kenny. Just fucking stay put. Jeez. I'm gonna have a word with Kenny. He doesn't have to treat him that way. Kid's been through enough. Let me talk to him, please. You all right here? Yeah, uh, yeah. No. Go on and talk to him. I got clam if I need him. No. Okay. Let me talk to him. Here, just Mike, you don't know him. He doesn't trust anyone but me. Okay. Oh, that was smart, Bonnie. Have him hold the baby. It'll keep Kenny what from getting too aggressive. Guys? What do you mean? Every man I've known is always trying to <laughs> let each other know how tough they are. Go, Bonnie. Put them in their place. Because guys are dumb. Such a dominant alpha male horse shit. And it all ends the same way. 
Now don't look at me. I ain't that guy. Oh, that ain't true. You get in your fair share of pissing matches too. Do I? Are you kidding me? Yeah, they're just scared. That's when it happens. When they don't know what to do. Saying that she's yeah, right, but also to me. it's kind of given some explanations so the guys don't feel like. Yes, it took a woman to talk some sense into him. Looks like Jane broke it up. Keep pressure on it, okay? I'm gonna go fetch some bandages. We need to make sure the bullet's not in there. That's that's gonna get infected. Hey, Bonnie. He says he feels like he went through, but we need to yeah? check to see if there's an exit wound. I'm sorry. For what? I'll be right back. Sorry for not being on watch. Sorry for starting <sighs> things. Dad. Damn it. How are you feeling? Probably I'm being bad. honest, uh, I've been better. We've all been better. Can we, like, work this out, Luke? Because you've been a dink recently. Try to get this sorted. How did we get here? We <laughs> walked. I know he doesn't mean that, but that would have been really funny. Sitting in the snow, leaning up against a tree, bullet in my leg. But alive. <laughs> when so many of my friends are dead for no good reason, and I couldn't do anything to stop them. Everyone <clears throat> we set out with just gone. Nick, Pete. Alvin and Becca, Carlos, Sarah. You can't blame yourself. It wasn't. It feels sort of hollow saying no. it though, because of I course he still blames done. himself. I could have done more, and that ain't up for debate. I know it in my bones, and I gotta live with it. All right. Just gotta it's do what work. you think is right. That's all we can hope for. That's perfect. What I miss? Hmm. Uh, nothing much. You know, complaining mostly. I'm trying to guess how far this is. to be honest. Luke's feeling bad about what happened. What? Really? But it's not your fault. Bad yeah, we need to express this. There's no need for this time. masculine. Right. I'm gonna hide all my you feelings. Don't go things. blaming yourself for this. All right. Can we drop it? I'm fine. Ugh! Why well, I gotta be stupid? Thanks a lot. Oh come on! Hey, Clem, Being a dink again. go over and see if you can change the bandages on Kenny's wound. Now he's not going to tell me stuff. I offered, but I don't think he was comfortable with me doing it. But you know him better than I do. Okay. Bad a girl. Since Luke's going to be stupid. That's going to sting, but only for a second. It's going to clean it. Oh, I know what it does. It's going to suck. It's got to get done. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that time we had to stitch our own wound. That was intense. Clem showed off her giant cojones. I was thinking we'd go with Alvin Jr. What do you think? Oh. Rebecca mentioned she'd like to name him Alvin if it was a boy. I mean, Rebecca was so out of it she hadn't settled on her name. I think his parents would have liked that. Yeah, me too. Alvin Jr. it is. Yeah, he has a name. Like Screw well, the wildlings and their rules. What do you uh, got there? Because I think I'm all right. Can I change your bandages? Yes. Say yes. You shouldn't have to do stuff like this. Well, it's a zombie have apocalypse. You do a lot of things. <laughs> all right. Let's get it over with. Thank you, Kenny. Hopefully it don't scare this little guy. Or you. Oh. I get to see behind his eye patch. So how's it look? I still gonna be pretty when this heals? Are you going to be okay? Oh, I'll be fine, darling. Gonna take a lot more than a couple smacks with the. Actually, not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be worse. Don't worry. It can't be that bad. Sorry. Come on. Click and drag. Here we go. That wasn't so hard. This is gonna suck, Kenny. Maybe. So, 
grab like a log. I'm guessing this is gonna be the shitty part. So this is gonna hurt like hell. Well, you could have lied a little, you know. <laughs> no. You need to stop squirming. Yeah. yeah. Maybe I can tell him a story about how I did You're this right. myself. Can we not have him hold the baby while I do this very delicate Sorry procedure? Sorry about the language, Junior. You're gonna be tougher than me when you're grown. I'm gonna expect you to be more of a gentleman than I am. Man, is that smart. He'll be tough. Just like his dad. Oh, Alvin didn't look it. But yeah. That guy had a pair of them. Let's keep him talking. You're right about me giving myself up. I can't believe I was willing to sacrifice Alvin just to hold out a little longer. We should have saved him sooner. Got him. He's opening up to me. I'm gonna think about that every time I look at Alvin Jr. here. He's so cute. Alvin should be here raising this boy. It should be him, not me. Carver's the one who did it, not you. Yeah, I suppose. But I can't help but feel guilty. Everybody feeling guilty. <clears throat> I wonder if I should have inspired him so that he'll raise him right. My only concern was that, you know, if he thinks that, you know, I shall raise him, that he won't let anyone else touch well him, that'll cause an Thank issue. You, sweetie. Yep. So. Are we ready to go? But I'm thinking that we sort of re-solidified our bond so that if I need to pull him back, he'll want to listen to me. Oy, oy, oy. So Let's many head things. Out. So we're going to stop this episode here. We're at just over 20 minutes, which is like a, a decent amount of time. Uh, Luke is being a whiny baby and is still annoying me. Because uh, we were even just talking about like male pig headedness things. And then when I go out of my way, like, this is how Luke's feeling. We should support him. He goes, like, thanks a lot, Clementine. Me. It's like, stop. So that's annoying. But then I think we rebounded nice with uh, helping Kenny. He seemed to open up to, open up to us and he said, you know, he was right when. I said he was losing touch and he was willing to sacrifice Alvin and blah blah blah. So he at least recognizes the damage uh, and is maybe thinking about that. I think AJ, little baby AJ will be inspiration. I think it was nice when Rebecca was there because then, you know, it was like the mom, you know, he would defer to her since it was her kid, but would look out for her. But the baby, and I think that if I need to pull him back because he's still sort of unstable, that he'll listen to me. But, uh... We'll see what happens. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Drop a like on this video if you enjoyed it. Comment down below your own personal experiences with the game, whether they're the same or different. And uh, subscribe if you haven't yet, if you're new to the channel. Um, we've been a little shaky on getting videos out consistently, but I'm hoping to fix that. Uh, you guys have been awarded some geek XP, and I'll see you all next time.